Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. My name is Amanda, and this is a brand new season of Amanda vs. Clutter. Yay! Alright, so if you haven't seen my other declutter and organization videos, I will put a link to the playlist right up there. Go ahead and check them out. So I started my declutter journey a few years ago and I decluttered a bunch <laughs> and I tried a couple different systems, different ways of doing it and you know, I still couldn't get rid of everything. <laughs> so just a couple years ago, I tried the minimalist challenge and I recorded it, but I never posted it. So this video is actually going to be footage from that. So the really awesome thing that came out of the minimalist challenge is I ended up having a really huge garage sale and got rid of so much stuff, but my house is still cluttered. So this is just going to be the start of a new season of decluttering my house again. Yay. It is in dire need of it. So before this video starts, let me explain a little bit of what the minimalist challenge is. It's to kind of jumpstart getting rid of a lot of items in your home is to get rid of the number of items that match the date. So the first of the month, get rid of one item. The second of the month, get rid of two items. The third of the month, get rid of three, so on and so forth. Down to, you know, the 30th of the month, get rid of 30 items. So it would accumulate over the course of the month to get rid of close to 500 items. Kind of depends on what month you do, how many days you have. All right, well watch this video and stay tuned to the end to get some more information about how you can join me in the Minimalist Challenge next month. Yay! Just being honest with you guys, today is the fourth. So that means I have to get rid of this one item for the first, two items for the second, three items for the third, and now for today would be four items. So if we count that all up, I'm pretty sure that's 10. One plus two plus three, I'm doing sign language, sorry, <laughs> plus four. So that's 10. You see it's the small one, the mini one, and then the big one. So here's my question. Does that count as one or does that count as three? Because I could have kept one of them. I don't know. I have a feeling as this month goes on, I'm going to be getting rid of more than what the date says to get rid of. So I think for now I'm going to count that as three. So today, being the fourth, I have to get rid of a total of ten things to make up for the first, second, and third of September. So I think I'll count this as three. So what this will be, this will be getting rid of one item for the first, and then these other two will be for the second. So I'm caught up through the second. So I'll get rid of that. There are three. So we had the first, the second, now the third. Here's one, two, three. Three items. So we got one, two, three, four, five. So I just did one extra today. Okay, so there is day five. Those are my one, two, three, four, five, six items for today. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine books, actually. Day eight. And day nine. That is my one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten items. I count these as two. You know, this is one and this is one. So there we go. Uh, day ten. Go yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Day twelve, and we are on the hallway floor again because this is where all of my stuff is. So. Um, that's why we are filming here. Okay, so 12, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. All right, before I start day 13, I gotta give my son this, so that's part of my thing. He wants to play with the cassette tape. Um, so now I'm kind of going through some of the stuff that you've seen on the side here. So day 13, so we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, the other one he has, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 and 13. Okay, so I have the bug, the declutter bug. I want to get rid of so much stuff. So there is definitely going to be more to this minimalism series, and I will be taking you along as I declutter my entire house. 
Um, so as you see today, this is a lot more than 14 items, but I have 14 groups of items. Now, I do have to say I've kind of cheated a little bit. I had this box here um, with some of these like hair things for a while, and I kind of set them aside to even like way before, honestly, it was probably like eight or nine months ago before I like heard about the minimalisms and all that. And I just kind of set it aside thinking, okay, if I use them and I go to this and pull them out, then I will keep them. And I haven't. So I kind of already had some of this group together. So it's kind of cheating, but it is a lot more than 14. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Day 15. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. I'm going to keep this bin and reuse it for something else, but I'm going to declutter all of these. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Day 17. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and a little one is 17. Day 18, and I got some clothes out of my closet. We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, uh, 9 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. All right, we are on day 19, and I'm having so much fun getting rid of stuff. Oh, my gosh. Um, I've now, like, started a stockpile of stuff that I want to get rid of because I'm trying to stick to the number of days and not get, like, too crazy getting rid of stuff. So I've had a stockpile of things that I'm just, like, each day I'm like, okay, this is what I'm going to get rid of today. But anyways, day 19, I'll count first. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Day 20. Okay, so um, I'm going to do, I'm going to insert a clip of two items that are not in here. They're too big. There's one is a small recliner, child's recliner um, for my son. And he just, we've tried putting in different places in our room. He just doesn't use it. So it just takes up a lot of space if he's not going to use it. So we're going to get rid of that. And then the other thing I decided to um, go ahead and get rid of the sewing machine and it actually it's going to go to my sister-in-law um, she's going to take it um, so I'm glad that it's going to stay in the family um, so this is 18 items that you see here plus those two so um, this is just a small representation I'm going to get rid of a bunch of hangers the recliner and the sewing machine Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. So it's day 22. Now before I show you, I don't feel bad showing you guys these undergarments because I'm not going to wear them and I'm going to give them away. But... I'm going to do it very quickly because I think it is weird to show undergarments. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. There we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Uh, let's see here, back there. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. All right, day 25. These are some things um, that I had saved and set aside to give to my kids and then realized that they aren't going to care and I don't care anymore. Um, well, some of these are Christmas books we had gotten last year and I just never really liked them, so I pared down as I'm starting to pull those out for Liam. So 25 items. Oh, and also a whole bunch of like jewelry stuff I gotten from like a lot of it's like costumey jewelry and anyways, yeah. So one, two, three, a little game. Four, five, six, 
7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. So there we go. Day 25. So here is my 26 items. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. Plus eight years. I told him to stay out of the way, and so he's pounding over there. So I collected Coca-Cola products, if you can't tell. This is, like, you have no idea the collection I had. I got rid of some stuff when I got married. I got rid of some stuff when we got rid of our storage unit. I got rid of some stuff whenever we tried getting all of the boxes unpacked in our house. I feel like I got rid of some stuff some other times, too. So, and this isn't even all of the stuff I have left that I'm trying to get rid of. This is just some, like, it's just, like, little bits and pieces that I'm just not even pulling out. I had stuffed animals. Anyway, so, this is some of it. It's 27 items. I will do my best to count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I'm counting all those as 1. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. This is for day 28. I have a mixture of stuff of my son's and some electronic cords and some cards. We've got, i um, kind of put them in stacks here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 3, 24, 25, 26, 27, and then the mat is 28. Day 29, I have 54 books here um, that are kids' books that either were mine or we got for my son or were given to us that we don't like. Uh, we don't like to read or we don't like them or my son doesn't like them or whatever reason. Um, I've reduced down, we had three sets, or three spots in our house for books downstairs on our bookshelf on the landing upstairs and in his room, but now we've reduced it all down to board books in the nursery and then in his new toddler room, the books that we do like. So, day 29. Here's the last day, day 30. Let me show you this and then I will do a final recap. Magazines. Yes, that many. I counted 100 and 45 magazines. Uh-huh. So I think that counts as 30, right? I need to get rid of 30 items. I think 145 magazines works. Mm-hmm. Yep, all sorts of different ones. Some I read, some I didn't. They've sat there. I haven't felt like I needed to go read them, so I haven't. I think it's time to get rid of them. I'm not sure if I'm going to like try to donate them somewhere that once magazines or just recycle them, but that's what I got, 145. Okay, and then I'll give you a final recap. Oh my goodness, I got rid of so many things. It felt so good. Now, from the footage that you saw, it did take me a little bit longer to get the garage sale actually going. I got rid of more stuff because I caught the bug. You saw there were several days. I was like, no, not just single items. Let's do a group of items. <laughs> which was so awesome and was great. Unfortunately, I didn't get rid of everything I needed to. Plus, you know, stuff keeps coming in the house. So I'm gonna do it again, and this is gonna help jumpstart my new season of decluttering in my home. I really wanna get closer down to being a minimalist. I have just found that there's just so much stuff it's just hard to keep track of and keep things clean. I really want to greatly reduce everything, so stay tuned to that on this channel. Subscribe so that you're notified when those videos come out, and please follow me on Instagram this month in June as I go through the Minimalist Challenge again. I would love for you to join me, tag me as you're getting rid of things too. Let's do this together. Let's get rid of the clutter. Let's clear the space, clear the mind. I think it's going to be a really great month. Y'all have a great day and I will see you in the next video.